before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Axel Grave back with more reactions with an X today. Happy to keep going on our battle mode spree with Duo Dreamer. We are now on episode 64, which is Darth Vader vs. Sephiroth. We're slowly making our way through all of this content, trying to catch up. I think he's on episode 100 and something. 100 and something, 110 maybe. I, I'm not sure at this point. I gotta double check. But he keeps plugging along, so we will too. I'm excited. Remember to support Duo Dreamer in battle mode by clicking the links in the description below where you can help them on their Patreon, on their YouTube, etc. He definitely deserves it. Makes great stuff. Makes stuff every week. If you wanted to subscribe, there's definitely reason to get new videos all the time. Uh, if you enjoyed watching with us, like, comment with a critique or a compliment. We could use both, honestly, to help improve both ourselves and the channel. And uh, if you liked watching this stuff, remember to hit the little bell, the subscribe button, so that you can get, uh, you know, information on uh, new stuff coming up. With that being said, we're going to get right into it and not try to introduce too much time. Battle Spend too much time introducing Initiate. words! Uh, yuck. Words! Uh, Jesus, I should have sold out that and bought Apple. That would have been the right move. Actually, didn't I sell most of my shit and buy Apple? Sorry, guys, talking about my stocks. Don't, don't, and for those who think it's a fool's game, why are the billionaires playing that game? Once they have millions to play it, but... Trust me, it's, it's one of those lies that they tell you that don't get into this, because, you know, it's not a guarantee. Nothing's a guarantee, man. I'm excited for this. I obviously think Sephiroth's gonna win based on power set, but Darth Vader has some pretty impressive feats, just not compared to Sephiroth, really. You know what I mean? Like that. That's a little more than what Darth Vader could do with his sword. He could do that with his force powers. My question is, can... Sephiroth's sword block a lightsaber. If it can't, then that is a real big problem for him. He's gonna have to dodge every hit. Nice quote. Right, so that, that would be my question, like, that becomes the biggest question of this fight, I think. A, right, he can block the lightsaber and it makes it a really not as interesting fight. I feel like Sephiroth's abilities, speed, power is probably above Vader's, right? Uh, in general, maybe not always. Vader not knocking him either. He's one of the strongest force users. I just feel like Star Wars was a little more uh, tame in their power levels and sets. Yeah. However, that's assuming that a cut and half Vader wouldn't still try to kill you, which I think we all know from uh, Revenge of the Sith, he absolutely would. Uh, having said that, that goes about the way I'd expect if the lightsaber doesn't cut Sephiroth. If the lightsaber can cut Sephiroth, all it takes is one swing. If his sword can't block it, then all he needs to land is one attack, which makes it a more realistic fight. I still think it's going to be real hard for Vader to hit Sephiroth at all, but... Once again, with that in mind, unless, I mean, Sephiroth might have some healing abilities I have zero idea about, but those shouldn't matter either because you caustically burn the area and then it <laughs> it seals that, so it's interesting. Uh, but I do agree Sephiroth would most likely win that like 9 out of 10 times. And as always, I, I've been talking over these way too much. Remember to support, do a dreamer, dream big, and do great things. Guys, man, I gotta shut up at the end of these videos. Um, but yeah, I, I really enjoyed that. There's some thoughts on it, but it really does go the way that I kind of thought it would go. As always, guys, thanks for watching Reactions with an X, and we'll catch you next time. Uh, stay tuned. Thanks, everyone, for watching another episode of Reactions with an X with me, your host, Axel Grave. I appreciate every single view and every single comment on these videos. If you enjoyed the video, remember to hit like to show your support hit subscribe to see more reaction videos. If you like the other content we do on the channel, remember to hit the little bell and press all to see all of our videos. Finally, if you wanted to leave us a comment or a suggestion on other material we to do, or just to rip us to shreds, leave a note in the comments and we'll try to get back to you.